Hi, it's Matty here from heypress2010.co.uk and today I've got a really useful tutorial for you on bake dynamics. So, basically when you bake something, it's almost caching the movement of it. So if you'll see, these uh, cloner objects have dynamic tags on them, so they fall. Uh, if we script through the timeline, you'll see they don't fall in real time. Okay, so there's two ways to do this. You can bake individual things by going to their um, tag. I'm going to cache and click bake object. So you'll see if we scrub through, that falls in real time when the other thing doesn't. But if you click Control D, it'll bring you to the project settings and you can cache the whole scene. So if you click bake, you'll see when you scrub in real time, everything falls in real time. I'll clear that first. There we go. So everything falls in real time. So I hope that makes animating a lot easier for you and helps you out. So as you can see on the video now with some of my older tutorials, check them out and I'll see you in the next video. Thanks for watching.